please. I've spent more than an hour looking around the village. And I told Grandma I'll be back in no time. I've not even gone to the market to buy the things I'm supposed to buy. God, I've seen beauty before, but who is this damsel? Jesus. Go after I'm sorry. Wasn't my okay. I'm Barbara. Full name for an episode of God. Like, I'm sorry. You didn't offend me. I was only tripping the words. I was a shopkeeper. Oh, oh. The difference. Actually, I opened the shop um, when I finished my OND in IMT. There was enough money so I could complete my HND. So, what about. I'm a first year student. Academic staff and strike. So, gives us opportunity to come and see me. The old man whose house is next to the Ewix. Oh, oh, you need grandma today? Exactly. Uh, I don't, sorry, but can you find your way home? You're new, that's what I mean. I don't understand. Do I look lost to you? It's no, just that, you know. Uh, just that you need some kind of protection, which I'm. Do you understand? Protection. For what? For whatever. This village, anything can help. Okay, fine. No problem. It wouldn't disturb you. Oh, no. You see, my shop. Unless what you mean to me, just few minutes that we just start. I, I don't. Know. But that's absolutely the truth. Through, okay. No problem.
wondering if I may ask, um, are you family? No, actually, I came to see my grandma. She stays there. So, yeah. No, it's just like, uh, I know all the places in this village. So, your own storage thing. Ask. But you can call it clear. Well, um, Grandma Ude is grand. Grandma Ude. Yes. I mean, this is beautiful. You like it? Are you serious? You love this painting. Are you an art collector? <laughs> no, I studied my art. I I studied my art. I went to Anisha to sell off my painting. So these are the leftover. Okay, okay. That's nice. Uh, do you like art that much? Of course I do. It's lovely. Okay, that means I invite you over to Really? Yes. Oh, I can't wait to be there. So, um, break the house where I can come and Okay, that's nice. I have to stop here. That's my grandma's place. Okay. So. Okay. Um, excuse me. You look like someone I met two days ago. Said his name. Are you his brother? Oh, duh. Oh, we are just two mates. He, he studied accounting while I did. So, we are just friends. Okay, nice. Thank you once again for helping me. My pleasure. If you don't mind, my name is Sly. Barbara. Barbara. Yeah. Thanks. I am. See you later. Don't forget to come up pick me. Right, bye. 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 so that he can address us. Patrick, please address us. Igwe. Elders, I greet you all. And first, let me thank you, Your Highness, for granting me your royal audience. I'm highly honored. Actually, I've come to broker some business with you and your uh, yeah. people. My friend. Okay, you better start living here. Look at all of us here. We are farmers, not. No, Your Highness. I'm an international art collector. Yes. Our <laughs> partners became interested in an art material in your domain. I see. And are ready to pay good money for it. Art? Then someone should take him to Loma some. He's the only artist we have in the entire village. Uh, but wait a minute. Uh, what's the name? Mr. Mr. Patrick. Uh, Mr. Patrick. Mark, what Mr. What type of uh, art materials are you looking for? Uh, the great masquerade mask of Obi. Hey! hey. Will you shut? Do you A bid for the symbol of our very existence. I understand all that, Your Highness. And I'm ready to pay adequately for any conveniences. Shut up, young man. You are desecrating our land with your utterances. To fear. That is right. Now, how much do you think you can pay? How much do you think you have that will make us to do some religious thing? It will. $50,000. And if you will. $50,000. And I'm very sure that would be enough to give this village a better masquerade. Shadow, brother, you are too much in the hurry. You say something. $50,000. <laughs> this is money. They give me money. Shadow. Shadow. This is money. The money is too much. With $50,000, ah, we can buy 20 new masquerades. I still have a uh, head change, you know. Are you my man? Igwe. If I give me. My fellow elders, uh, I don't think I have any business here.
Yohanes, saat. Oh, you are still here? Go now. They say the master is not for sale. Go before I order the guards to throw you out. Have you been finding the village? Fantastic. In fact, Grandma, it's so natural and lovely. <laughs> what about the people? Oh, they are nice and social. I've already met two interesting friends. Really? Yes. Who are they? One introduced himself as Dawn, and the other one Sly. Dawn and Sly? Yes. Dawn and Sly. You mean uh, Donatus and uh, Slevanos? Yes. My dear. They are very good boys. When did you see them? I met Dawn three days ago, then Sly. I met Sly yesterday. Is that so? Oh, oh Sly is there. Hello. Hi, Baba. Good afternoon, Ma. Good afternoon, my son. How are you? I'm fine. Baba, uh, Barbara told me she's your granddaughter. Yes, she is, my dear. She is such a nice hey, girl. She's a beautiful girl. Yes. And she was just telling me about you a few minutes ago. Oh. oh, Barbara, I hope you painted me in a fake color to her. Of course. Seems you did all the painting yourself. She just sang your praises to the high heaven. Ah, oh, that's nice. I'm so glad to hear that. Um, actually, I came to pick her so that she will see some of my artworks. My compact. Your artworks? Yes, ma. Barbara. Yes, Grandma. I love artworks very much. Um, my dear. Grandma. <laughs> I don't understand. Are you through with the drawing? Oh no, I have the sketch already. So by this time tomorrow, I've made an artistic representation of this creative work of Master of Creation. And I'm going to consider that the greatest honor anyone has ever done to me. Thank you. Honor and virtues are twins. Will you are virtuous? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Absolutely beautiful. Wow! Isn't it? None of them is as beautiful as you. Come on, Barbara, looking at you when I was doing this sketch, I felt like I was in a transcendental room doing a highly divine commission painting of the celestial elements. The living angel, Barbara. Ah. Seems you're an artist, even your choice of words. I, I know, your beauty is good enough to make even an imbecile an artistic genius. I can't believe me when I say all this. I love you. Did you my dear friend? You? Mm. Sly, we are friends already. <sighs> okay, but being your girlfriend, I think we should allow nature to take care of that. No, Barbara. Barbara, are you afraid of what your people will say or what people will think about oh, when they get to know about it? Sly. I'm not the type that bothers about what people say, okay? Oh, uh, okay, all right, all right. I'm sorry if I annoyed you. Uh, I'm really sorry. But you should understand, I really, I really, I really need you deep inside my heart. Thank you. All right. So, um, what's the time here? Past eight. Oh, my God. Grandma, I have to get going. Oh, uh, okay, okay, okay. Wait. Let me see. Oh, no problem.
I'm sorry the food is arriving late. I know you must be famished. Mama, I'm not hungry. Manu, Silvenus, you've been working out here since morning. Eh? I know you're angry the food is arriving late, but I'm sorry. Mama, I've not been working so that I can eat your food. Mama, can't you say I'm busy? I will eat later. Just keep it. Please. Sure? Yes, Mama. Go to the mountain, the mountain will go to Mohammed. Too bad she didn't come so that we can continue this to be. Barbara, I'm, I'm not saying it's the best thing to do, but I know you can do it, okay? And my love will help you cope with it at any time. You know, I do really love you. Come on, it. Eh? Doesn't platonic relationship exist in this village? Why is everybody talking about love, love, love? Ah, ah, what no, is it? No, Papa, you don't have to place me among those bandwagons of boys that follow you around, okay? There is no bandwagons of boys following me around, Dawn. I have only two friends in this village. And both of you have been chasing me around the whole village with the same demand. Will I kill myself? Eh, eh, excuse me. Excuse me. Who is this other guy? Hey. You know me, I said you guys were in the same school together. What is his name? Sly. See what? Hey! What is it? Hey! What is it? Why did you that day? You what? Why did Tell that me forget? What? Hey! Go, 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 go. Did he touch you? No, he ah. did not. Hey, he didn't touch you. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Didn't your mother tell you anything about Tell me what? No, do, you, do you know him? This was it for that. Aha! I have never seen Baba is epileptic. When we're in school, when we're, no way, when we're doing our own, that I fell one or twenty times before the full glare of several students. Hey! See, to what's him at all? He was just, they just recently diagnosed him of, um, what's he called? Tuberculosis. Don't worry. Jesus Christ. Are you serious? Hey! Hey! Then how then does he manage these health problems at the same time to do his hard work? Have you seen him do, do the redrawing himself? Who told is the one that does this thing? He doesn't talk. It is the mother. And the only thing he does he, just, he, is just to market the mother's jobs. That's all. They know those works. That's what he does. And that is outside this village. Not, in, not even in this village. Because nobody from this village will agree to touch whatever thing he touches. Man, you took everything. Eh? I'm, I'm no, we've not finished now. We're talking about something please, important. I'll, I'll Before you leave this dead master. Don't start. Ba Barbara! Barbara! Like what? I'm fine, I'm okay. You're not fine. You're not fine. Okay, why are you closing your mouth and nose as we are talking? Hmm. How do you perceive it? Perceive Something is smelling around here. Hmm. Smelling? Hmm. Papa, I don't understand what you're talking about. I have finished your portrait and waited for you. I couldn't see you. So I decided to call myself. Let's go so that you can pick it. Go where? No, please. Um, um just go, okay? I'll come and collect it. Okay, okay, don't worry. I'll bring it myself so that I can talk there after. Okay. No, don't, don't even come, please. Please, I've told you. In fact, I don't want it anymore. Because I don't want it. For what now? Jesus Christ. Papa, you are behaving strange today. Why? In fact, okay, okay, let me just tell you. Okay, I'm not interested anymore. Even the portrait, even you coming to see me. I, I am not interested. Please, please, I, I beg you. Don't even come and see me. Please, oh. I'm begging you.
in the past three days, Barbara has shown that she accepted what I told her and she's keeping that food at arm's length. By the time I finish talking with her today, she will avoid that boy like leprosy. Today is today. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry for the embarrassment I gave you the other day. I mean, I can't tell the reason right now, but he must believe me. But I've told you to forget about that. I didn't even call it anything. Yes, I was really hot about that. Uh, it ended that day. It's okay. Thank you very much. Honestly, you have been a great company, and I must confess, you've made my staying in this village worthwhile. Um, Barbara, making you happy is a duty I derive on a farm. You see, you are the epicenter of my dream. The house where I want my love to live forever. I'm serious. Sly. You're absolutely poetic. But you have to be patient with me on that. I mean, you and Donna... Hey, hey, no, 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 please. Don't mention that madman name here. Anytime I'm talking to you, don't mention that name. Is he not your friend anymore? Was he calling me madman? No, I didn't, I, I didn't say that to spite him. Meanwhile, I'm sorry to tell you this about him. You are just discharged from psychiatric home last three months. Yes, he's very good in mathematics. But fortunately, during our days in school, he ran mad. Yes, just mad. Trying to solve one mathematical problem like that. John, yes. a madman. Yes, you have to watch how you go closer to him. Because he still suffers the moose of that madness in him from time to time. You understand? That makes him very, very violent. Can't you notice that? Are you sure of this? I'm sure I don't want you to be a victim, that's why I'm telling you. Yes. If you watch him very well, you'll find out. I'm serious. Hey. And we have to get going. You want to go? staying at home so I decided to stroll. Oh but so why didn't you stroll towards my house? Oh you don't want to see me again? What do you mean I don't want to see you? I don't know. What I don't like is about you and Dawn embarrassing yourselves because of me. I mean how can you guys fight at the market square knowing fully well your village forbids it? Barbara forget that. Donatus was taking too much and I needed to teach me a lesson. Really? The borders by the way. Just forget it. Thank you. This is beautiful. Do you like it? Yes, I love it. I'll hang it by my bedside when I go back to school. Okay. And I'll use it to remember you. Oh. 
Lucy Bobber. Forget about that useless portrait I give to you. It can never guarantee your future. The coaching I'm giving to you how to solve accounting problems will. Okay? Look, I accepted to bear the, the, the cost of those sacrifices last week just because of you. Okay? Even though it nearly ruined my, my business, but I don't care. The only thing I, I care is, is one thing, uh, and that is my love for you, okay? I'm really, really sorry about the losses you killed and the sacrifice. I mean, if only you and Sly would just get off this, this rivalry stuff. Like, this, this whole thing, it won't happen again. God. But, baby, isn't it time you accept my proposal? I mean, haven't I, haven't I shown you uh, uh, in a very tangible, I mean, very tangible ways that what I have for you is far more than what you understand? Papa, I, I, I love you just for the boss lie, okay? I love you, eh? Don, I've told you times with that number. Let's just leave nature to the side of this. Eh? The way you guys are going about this, you, you end up scaring me away. Oh, God forbid. See, I'm sorry. I'm just sorry. Papa, I'm, I'm, I'm very, very sorry, okay? I won't talk about it again on, until you give me to give me signal to forge ahead, eh? I'm sorry. I'm just sorry. Okay. Smile for me now. Let me know that you've accepted my apology. I'm sorry. Bobby, my baby. Okay. You promised you bring me corn and the beer. Me? Uh -huh. Promised you. Uh -huh. When? I did not promise you. You have dug your graves. You have dared the devil and you are going to pay dearly for it. In the past three years, we have been grappling with the wicked fact that you collectively sent our mentor, Obalo, to prison. Now we have decided to strike back at you and we are going to make Obinago a boiling cauldron. Just as Osama bin Laden did to America on September 11th, 2001. We will bomb your foolish village until we reduce it to rubbles. <laughs> we will make you shed tears of blood and nothing will stop us. Signed, Movement for the Freedom of <laughs> Abalog. So, Luigi, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I'm leaving Ubinago now. After all, Abalo was sent to jail ever before I became king. Hmm. Igwe, just relax. There is nothing to be afraid of. Eh? By the way, when did this letter come to you? This morning, through the postman. He will start thinking of how to defend Ubinago if I must stay. Don't you hear me? This is serious. The letter is full of threats and no demands from the faceless group. I'm afraid they're that. It's not because I'm afraid of or running to any other or not. Let me tell you. Would you afford a number of to bomb? Once the bomb lands, Dumam! Or for Nonegia Ngari. Go to Smithrins. Your Highness. The people can only succeed in bombing Obinago if they can penetrate it. You see, the best thing is we have to arrange and recruit all able-bodied men of Obinago to man all the strategic positions and all the entry points to Obinago, both day and night. Hmm. I think you are right. But what about my palace? Uh, Iwe, don't you think we should get the police involved in this? Police? Ha! Huh. That's right. I think you are right. Yes. Jonah, you are right. But I think involving the police will worsen the situation. Then we leave all our flanks open. I think you are right. I bet Iwe, 
What about uh, consulting the other? It's better. Aha! Uh -huh. The custodians of our culture. Yes. I think it's better. But what do we do? It is safer not to say what you don't know about. In that case, I think I'm right. Just bomb the entire village. It's not what I believe in, don't worry. It's about obeying my grandmother. Besides, I don't think it's good to remain skeptic when everyone else in this village knows there could be real danger out there. Listen, Barbara, you are with Don. I mean, even if the bomb scare becomes real, I'm ready to give anything for everything in my life to secure yours. The fact is that you don't even know how much you mean to me. That's why you talk all these things. Well, you have to convince my grandmother, or else I won't be coming out for those lessons again. No, no, no. I mean, my life is more important to all the knowledge in the world, don't you think so? I know. Okay. I'll do that. I'll talk to you when I want to get you out. Fine. So that was it. I was returning to the house with Don after my lesson. Ah, where is he? I don't know. He ran away immediately. The bombs went off. Oh, forget that selfish soul. I've told you to stop me chatting with that guy. He, he, he immediately I heard the sound of the bomb. I, I, it occurred to me that he must be somewhere looking for help. That's why I left everything I was doing, including my mom, in search of you. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. God bless okay. you. It's, it's okay. Yeah, a lot should be demonstrated in practical times, in times like this. And that's what I did. Like this. Let's worry about it. It's okay, nothing will happen to you. Let's go now. Even if it's a summer bill, let him come. I will show him the difference between capital B oh. and Khaled. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you, Your Highness, for the color. 
In fact, the mood for which it was offered and the manner for which it was eaten is a clear indication that today's deliberation will be very fruitful. And His Highness, we caused this meeting with you to inform you that the usual thing has happened. Which uh, usual thing has happened, DJ? <laughs> Your Highness, the new moon was sighted last night. Thank God. <laughs> Thank God. You see, I'm already tired of um, eating corn and um, dry yams, you know? Uh, which means now I can now go ahead and harvest my new yams. God forbid. Your Highness, mm. the customary has to be observed first. Yes. Oh, oh, you know I almost forgot that, you know. Yes, you are right. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. Mm -hmm. You know, new yams are very tasty. Yes. So, uh, which customer rice are we to observe first? Uh, but Igwe, you were the person who performed it last year. When you were father, who was the last thing they were sick? Yes. Oh, yes. What is that supposed to mean, Chemon? <sighs> what is that supposed to mean? If you don't want to tell me, I will just go ahead and harvest my new yams. And in fact, order everybody to do likewise. No, no, no. What type no, no. of nonsense question is that? I'm sorry, Your Highness. But the custom demands that uh, you make some sacrifices at the shrine of the great oracle of Udunago for seven days. Mm -hmm. The new yams can then be harvested after the festival is successfully over. You are right. Um, how long will that take? 16 days, Your Highness. Mm -hmm. So what? 16 days. So 16 yes. days? Yes. Mm. All right, you are right. I will do the sacrifice, but uh, <laughs> I don't think I can wait. Oh. Uh, uh, in the place, you will have to do wait. 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 All right. Forgotten the pumpkin leaves I, um, I brought from the farm yesterday for Igwe's wife. Oh. Hey. And this would have been the best opportunity to give it to her. And I can't go back to get it now. Oh. I'll be late for the women's meeting and I don't have any money to pay for the fine. Let's go. Let's oh, go. No, no, Mama. Let me go to the rush back home and get it for you since I'm going to the palace already. That's very kind of you. You know where the key to the house is? Yeah. Okay. Do that quickly, eh? Okay. Do that and come. Okay. All right? Okay. okay.
beginning to suspect Judah. And that man he brought here the other day to come and buy the face of the oracle. Your Highness, I suspect him too. But how can an oracle allow itself to be stolen by a stranger? What do you expect the oracle to do? At least strike him down with paralysis if it can't kill him. Listen, I am beginning to doubt the potency of this oracle. Yes, he will. I found the face of the last oracle. And I decided to return it. I decided to return it. Your man. How did this get to your house? I don't know. You don't know? Yes. I was keen your life. We're out there. Igwe. Igwe. We are back. After consulting the oracle, our findings show that it was Donatus, hmm? the son of Jonah. Who stole the face of God? Aaron. Yeah. What do we do? What do we do? Igwe, our tradition says that if any uninitiated person touches the face of the oracle, that person should be punished. You're right. Mm -hmm. That's what the tradition says. You are right. Both of you are hereby punished. Eh? And the to the youth. Hey. Hey. But Igwe. Igwe, there's something you can do. What? Igwe, look at them. A young men. They don't know the customs of our land, Igwe. Do something, Igwe, please. I think Jonah is right. Yes. Igwe. Hmm. What are you saying? I think Jonah is right. Yes. Look, the punishment is banishment. Yes. No more, no less. I think you are right. Uh-uh. Both of you are hereby banished. <laughs> Ta! Hand them over to the youths. One, take them to the border between our village and Akeza. Igwe. And uh, this is final. Igwe. Igwe. Call me the chief priest and you are still sitting. What do I do? Hey! Chimo! 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 Chimo!
I see you again. Tell me who tell me. Where do I find my son again? Where? 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 How? How? How would I be here all alone? that all my dreams of raising enough money to go back to school died with my father. And if I can take care of myself and my mother, I have to leave the village in search of greener pasture in the city. Here I am today. My father made me promise him on his deathbed that I must take care of everything. But I don't even know how I can do that again. I have nobody here, no money, nothing at all, nothing Chima. I'm just confused. No, what to do again? It's all right. It's all right, Sly. It's all right. It's all right. All hope is not lost yet. I'm so sorry about your father's death. Thank you, Chima. But um, see, I lost my own parents at infancy, and as you know, my grandmother took me to your village where she single-handedly raised me up. When she died soon after we finished secondary school, I, I found myself in your present condition. You were my best friend then, Sly, and you could see that I was the type that never gave up. I had to leave the village for this city in order to survive, just like you've just done. Look at me today. I am a proud owner of this thriving business. Ha! It's not true. How come? Well, it's a long story, my brother. It's a long story. I can only say that God simply used strangers to help me. Now, what exactly do you intend to do in the city? Business? Basically, yes. Perhaps all I need now is a place that I can display my paintings. And a place that I can lay down my head at night. That's all. Drawing is a good profession. And I know with God on my side I will make it. That's my belief. And I will make it. I like that belief. I like that. I like that. Uh, will this place be good enough for you to display your artworks? I mean like displaying them right in front of my shop there. You mean? Why not? If you feel this place is good enough for you to display your artworks, feel free. I, I have a space right behind here. I can get a table for you there and you can stay there and draw your artworks. I even have a room in this compound. So you are free to stay with me as long as you wish. <laughs> Thank you, Chima. You can so great. Are you kneeling down? Oh, Sly, don't take do that. Take it, take it, take it. Take it take you, have, you don't have to kneel down for me. No what are friends for? Take it, take what are friends for? It's no big deal. Much. If strangers could help me, I mean, why shouldn't I help you, my friend? It's no big deal. Oh. There. Slide. God, how long will I continue like this? For how many days now I've been roaming the streets of this city, looking for jobs to no avail? 
and sleeping in buses and places like this. I'm sure I will run out of money by weekend if nothing comes my way. If that happens, God, who will I run to? I know I have sinned gravely against you, God. Please forgive me and save me, please. God. Did you read the advertorial well, Mr. Donatus? Yes, ma, I did. And I, I, I believe I am qualified for it. I'm afraid you're not qualified. I advertised for an agile and able-bodied personal assistant, not a houseboy. And uh, even if I want a houseboy, you don't qualify. But ma, I am able-bodied, agile, and possess the Requisite academic qualifications for this job. If you give me the job, I'll give you my words. I will carry out my functions with utmost commitment and sincerity. How? In all respects, you don't qualify. Please, Ma, let my capabilities and not my size speak to you. I don't need the job just because I want to survive off it. I need the job because I know I can do it and do it very well. And at the same time, earn my pay. I'm sorry, Mr. Donatus. I can't help you. Oh, Mr. Donatus. Job blame on what happened. I apologize for it. I'm asking you again, Jonah, what do you want here? I want us to put our differences behind and think about our future. There's no future for me until my son returns. I don't think you're right there, Oloma. You see, the future might have a better prospect for us if only you can oblige me demand of what I want from you. Go ahead. Local Loma, I want you to be practical about this. I want us to raise other children what? for you and myself. What? 
Did I hear you right, Jonah? Pull on. I'm still very young. You are still young. And if you can agree with me, under three years, we can have two boys. One for you, one for me. Ah, yeah. so if I got you right, you are asking me to be your mistress and produce children for you? No, and produce children for us. Yes, from look of things, Donatus and Sylvanus are dead. They have not reached us since they were banished. So, don't you think that we raise children and forget about them, please? I see. I'll go and get you some food for this wonderful um, idea. Hmm? Yes. We will start today. That's exactly what I want to hear from you. That's exactly what I want to hear from Thank you. Very sharp imagination. Oh, thank you very much. Huh. So how much is it? Just fifteen thousand. Fifteen thousand. Fifteen thousand? Yes. Sly. You have really challenged me. And I promise you, I'll surprise you. Alright, let me get my bed on. Ma, excuse me. Do you like this? Oh, it's very beautiful. So how much is it? No, 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 no. Just for you, for trusting me. For me? Yes, madam, take it. Oh, for me, it's for Sly. You. It's for you. Oh, you can't stop embarrassing me with kids. <laughs> I said I will. Oh my god. Don't worry, I'll surprise you. Okay. Alright, get into the vehicle. Okay. To take care of your company's accounts and to offer professional advice on monetary matters, ma. And are you doing that? You are doing that and we cannot account for 2.8 million naira in two months. Madam, it still baffles me. How? It baffles you. That's to say you're not competent. Oh, yes. You, you just... I've heard the food. <sighs> Thank you. I have heard you. Uh, 
uh, talking above your voice. Is anything the matter? Is it not this moron who calls himself my chief accountant? He has messed up everything in the accounting records. And I'm afraid we're about to lose 2.8 million naira. Madam, I think. You think what? Did I employ you to think? I employed you to work. Is it not the balancing sheet you, you submitted to me? Excuse me, let me. Can I look into it? Um, there's nothing you can do here. You can't help here, okay? Go to the secretary. Ask her to give you those letters. Take them to J and J International, okay? Quick. I've already done that. Um, can, can I look into it? I'm an accountant. Have you arranged those files in my office, Donatus? Yes, I did. You were there when I arranged it. Just take it. And listen, Mr. Sunday, I will not take any of this. I will call my bank now. If this whooping disparity reflects on the company's main accounts, I'll have no choice than to arrest and detain you until you pay every cover of my money. What you want? Excuse me, ma. There was no disparity or fraud in this. It's just some, it's just some balancing mistakes here and there. Um, you see, if you lift this figure and bring it here and place this one here, then it will reflect that both are not incomes within the period under review, but expenditures. Um, if you do that, then you will close the disparity and the total balance. Um, so I think you need to prepare another balance sheet to be on the safe side. Thank you, Dantus. Thank you. Thank you, Dantus. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Sunday. From today henceforth, he becomes the deputy chief accountant. Is that clear? Now, get out. Out. All these mommy's kids. But girl, if you hear him talk, he is very smart. Mm -hmm. And his brother says it all. I'd like to meet him. Exactly. I, I begin to wonder, girl, if God has decided to take away knowledge from the, the wise and prudent and give it to the suckling. I don't understand what you mean. You know that boy I employed as an errand boy out of sympathy? Yes. Good. That boy is making waves in the office. Really? I'm not kidding you. He does the accounting jobs while my chief accountant watches. Really? Yes. Mm. He surprises me every day, my girl. Here you are talking about a boy who made that exquisite painting. Are you really sure of what the type of boy in your house? <laughs> Do I joke with things like that? Ah, come on, girl. Are you thinking what I'm thinking now? About our still business with those small guys. What? Let me whisper to you. That is exactly what I mean. Fool me. Those guys could be used as birds. Your head is not empty. Exactly. Your head is not empty. Oh my God. So, how has the weekend been? 
But I don't really have busy weekends. If not that I have promised that I come, but I don't really go out on weekends. I do rest, but that's the way it should be anyway, but sometimes you need to go out and meet people. You know, with a profession, I guess you would do better if you get to know many people. Well, I think you're right, madam. But I'm just starting. I'm not even up to a year in town. All right. I want us to go and meet a friend. Then after that, we'll go for lunch. How about that? It's okay. I've been there calling you my friend 